Over 30% of all undergraduates who enrolled at SFU four years ago have already dropped out. Over half of those who dropped out did so within their first year, indicating many of them had difficulties adjusting to the social and academic demands of university life. It's also the case that students in degree programs related to the sciences, technology, engineering, and mathematics, or what's known as STEM fields, are much more likely to drop out than students from non-STEM degree programs. My thesis research examined a variety of personality traits in relation to adjustment difficulties among 135 undergraduates at SFU in an effort to explain these alarming dropout rates. To form my hypotheses, I drew upon autism research, which finds that many people with autism display above average knowledge of various topics, including math, science, and even computer syntax, while at the same time experiencing major deficits in social interactions and communication skills. Some scholars have suggested an inverse relationship between these two domains, such that highly technically minded people who are drawn to rule-based systems characteristic of STEM fields may find the social world somewhat baffling because social interactions do not seem to follow a logical progression or prescribed set of rules. I wondered if personality traits consistent with this profile could help explain adjustment difficulties in my sample. Of all the autistic traits I examined, pragmatic language difficulties, or the social aspects of communication, emerged as the strongest predictor of adjustment, such that higher levels of pragmatic language difficulties were associated with lower levels of adjustment. People with pragmatic language difficulties tend to miss social cues. They may talk about themselves too much without showing interest in others. And they seem to find basic social interactions confusing or challenging. It's likely that these type of difficulties inhibit the ability of students to form quality relationships with peers and instructors, which could create a variety of social and academic problems. As I predicted, pragmatic language difficulties displayed highest in STEM students. And STEM students also scored lower in some measures of adjustment. Using mediation analysis, I was even able to demonstrate that the high prevalence of pragmatic language difficulties within STEM students is explaining variance in adjustment beyond what could be explained by their major itself. A recent large-scale survey by the National Association of Colleges and Employers found that of the 20 most important skills employers desire of university graduates, communication skills ranked number one. So why is this skill set almost entirely ignored in higher education? It's time to start a discussion about how to foster communication skills in our students, especially STEM students. Not just to help them adjust to the university environment, but also to ensure degree completion and future job success. Thank you.